Welcome to the best two hours of fishing I've ever had in my entire life. The number one question I always get asked is, where do you catch all your fish in Idaho? Simply put, find moving water, scout online on Google Maps, and find places people aren't willing to go. Oftentimes you'll see my shoes are wet. That's because I'm wading through the water without waders or swimming across the water so I can catch some of these giant fish. So I fished for two hours in this one spot and I was just banging a Rapala off these laydowns um, of either logs coming down the river or just off the rocks, just twitching it through the current extremely fast, like absolutely rapidly fast, absolutely rapidly fast. What did he say? Just making a ton of casts. Um, that way I'm getting reaction strikes and anytime you see where there's a point of a rock bed coming, usually there's a dip right there and there will always be a trout just sitting on the edge of that. I think nine times out of 10 I catch a fish doing that, just bouncing it off the rocks right on the edge in the tip of that. There will be setting up on that point waiting for, if there's bubbles and foam right on that edge, there will be always fish. And that's how I caught these next giant fish that are super fat. Are you kidding me? After I caught this fish, I moved down river and then actually knocked on a door to get permission to cut through the person's property I to fish the, the other shore to get it, but another absolute giant. Look at the size of that one. Absolute pig of a fish. Just released this guy. He's swimming up current. Such a good feeling. See if I can get him in the main river. Seems kind of tired. There it goes, right there. Well, I just lost a 20 incher and then I caught this guy. It's probably like 17, 16 inches. Not a bad one. Bow cut on a Rapala. A couple casts later. 
My goodness. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. We're almost to a thousand. Thanks for watching.